In this video, we will take a look at what we mean by the depth of a node with respect to the data structure trees. So, the depth of a node is going to be the number of edges in the path from the root of the tree to that node. So, let me write that down. The depth of a node is the number of edges in the path from the root of the tree to that node. So let's take a tree as an example and see whether we can calculate the depth of all the nodes in that tree. So this is going to be my example. So now, when we are going to see paths which go from the root to the other nodes, we are going to take a path in which all the edges are going to point downwards. So let's start calculating the depth of each of these nodes, starting at the root. So, the root in this case is A. Now, the number of edges in the path from A to the root, which is A, is going to be 0. Because the path from A to A has no edges. So, it's going to have uh, 0 edges. So, it's going to have a depth of 0. So, A has a depth of 0. So, now let's look at B. The path from A, which is the root, to that node, which is B, is going to have one edge. So the depth of B is going to be one. Similarly for C, the number of edges in the path from A to C is equal to one. So the depth of C is going to be one. Let's look at D. The number of edges from A to D are going to be two. So the depth of D is two. Similarly, for E, the number of edges from A to E are going to be 2. It's the same for F and the same for G. Now, when we come to H, the number of edges from A to H are going to be 3. Similarly, for I. As you can see, the depth of a child node is going to be 1 more than the depth of its parent. You can see this because H and I are going to be the children of D and their depth is going to be 3 which is 1 more than the depth of D which is 2. This is because if the root takes a certain amount of edges to reach the parent, it will only take one more edge for that path to reach the child. That is the edge between that parent and the child. So what have we said? We have said that, first we said that the root has a depth of 0 and the depth of a child node is equal to 1 plus the depth of a parent node. So, using this logic, you can find out the depths of all the nodes in a given tree.